The Zuzana 2 is a recent Slovak self-propelled howitzer. It was developed by Constructed Defense. It is a new version of the original Zuzana. It is armed with a new 52 caliber gun and has a longer firing range. This artillery system also has a redesigned forward control cab and a number of other improvements. The Zuzana XA-1 prototype was first publicly revealed in 2008. Later this artillery system was renamed from Zuzana A-1 to Zuzana 2. Currently it is among the most advanced artillery systems in the world. In 2018 Slovak Ministry of Defense ordered 25 of these artillery systems. Deliveries began in 2021. These replace and service the relatively modern Zuzana artillery systems that were delivered between 1998 and 2000. In 2022 at least 8 to 12 Zuzana 2 Houtizers were delivered to Ukraine in order to defend against the Russian invasion. Furthermore Denmark, Germany and Norway agreed to fund production of another small batch for these howitzers for Ukraine. Unlike many self-propelled howitzers, the Zuzana 2 is based on an armored 8x8 wheel chassis. Such chassis is less expensive to build and to maintain comparing with tracked chassis. The Zuzana 2 is armed with a turret-mounted 155mm L52 gun howitzer. The gun is mounted externally between two separated compartments of the turret. It is fitted with an autoloader. Shells and charges are being loaded automatically at any elevation of the gun. The crew is completely isolated from potentially dangerous gun and autoloader mechanisms and is protected from the powder gases generated during firing. Turret traverse is 360, however firing envelope is limited to 60. The Zuzana 2 fires all standard NATO 155mm shells. This self-propelled gun howitzer is capable of both direct and indirect firing. The Zuzana 2 can carry three main types of ammunition, including standard high-explosive shells, extended-range high-explosive shells and high-explosive anti-tank shells for direct firing at unarmored targets. Range of fire depends on the shell and charge combination. Maximum range of fire is 41 kilometers with rocket-assisted shells. A total of 40 shells are carried by this artillery system. Ammunition is stored in conveyors. Beds and conveyors are universal for all 155mm shells and charges. There is a fuse setter for automatic setting of electronic fuses. This artillery system can launch 6 shells within the first minute or 16 shells within 3 minutes. Manual loading is possible if the autoloader fails. Manual rate of fire is 2 shells per minute. Sustained rate of fire is around 1.5 shells per minute. This artillery system is capable of multiple round simultaneous impact firing, MRSI. It can launch a couple of shells at different trajectories in order for them to hit the target simultaneously. The Zuzana 2 has an automatic gun laying mode. Firing data is calculated by the onboard computer and the gun is laid on the target automatically. This artillery system is fitted with navigation system. Onboard fire control system allows to operate with digital maps. There is also a roof-mounted 12.7mm machine gun for self-defense. Armor of the Zuzana 2 provides protection against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Front arc withstands hits from 14.5mm armor-piercing rounds. Vehicle is fitted with NBC protection and automatic fire extinguishing system. This artillery system has quick preparation for firing and brief redeployment time. Hydraulic stabilizers are lowered into the ground before firing. The Zuzana 2 is operated by a crew of four, including commander, gunner, loader and driver. This system has a high level of automation. This artillery system uses a special 8x8 chassis developed by Tatra. Vehicle has a new power pack. It is powered by a new and significantly more powerful Tatra T3B9 28.70 turbocharged diesel engine, developing 442 horsepower. A prototype was powered by a manned D2876 LF diesel engine, developing 453 horsepower engine is located at the rear. It is mated to a Tatra 10-speed gearbox. Vehicle is fitted with a central tire inflation system. However it has inferior cross-country performance comparing to that of tracked vehicles. 
Turret is fitted with independent auxiliary power unit, which powers all systems when the main engine is turned off. Normally a battery of Zuzana 2s would be supported by a fire control vehicle. Also there is an ammunition supply vehicle with an armored cab, based on Tatra 8x8 military truck. However, if required, each Suzana 2 can operate on its own. Diana is a 155mm tracked self-propelled howitzer. It is armed with a new 55 caliber gun. The turret is mounted on a Polish tracked chassis that uses many components of the T-72 tank. It is powered by an S-12U engine, developing 820 horsepower. A prototype was first publicly revealed in 2015. This artillery system was aimed at an Indian Army requirement, but is also proposed for other possible customers. 